crossover SUV behind me is one of the best values in the midsize segment, and given a few minutes, I'll show you exactly why I feel this way. First of all, it's a Hyundai, a brand that's known for delivering more goods for less cash than most rivals. But the new Santa Fe takes things even further than the brand has in previous generations by making this crossover extremely stylish, wonderfully refined, and filled with upscale features. As expected, the Santa Fe has grown from its slightly larger than compact dimensions to a true mid-size SUV, with major improvements in passenger and cargo capacity, plus a solid feel at the wheel that the previous model didn't quite achieve. Don't get me wrong, the old Santa Fe was very capable, but similar to how the previous Accent pales in comparison to the new one, or the new Sonata is miles more refined than the 2005 model, or for that matter, how the flagship Azera makes the mind quickly forget the wannabe luxury XG350, the Santa Fe feels more like an Acura or Lexus than a bargain basement SUV, at least when outfitted in top-line perforated leather-clad trim. And parents, you're gonna love how roomy it is back here. There's so much room, even for larger teenagers. And for the younger ones, well, there's an armrest with integrated cup holders. And the seat folds down 60-40 for a nice flat loading floor, opens up a lot of space. Oddly enough, you can only access the third row from this side of the vehicle. There's a little lever under here, and the seat folds up easily with enough room to walk through. And as you can see, a full-size adult fits in quite nicely. Now the Santa Fe isn't even Hyundai's most expensive SUV. The Vera Cruz takes that honor. And this model isn't even the top-line Santa Fe, but it feels so rich in here. Even this cloth trim is beautifully done and the leather steering wheel, the plastic is, isn't really soft touch, but it's got a nice matte finish and it looks good. The detailing of this center stack is nice too and the buttons feel really good. All around, a nicely, nicely laid out interior. Pretty top tier stuff for a Hyundai. The 2.7 liter V6 lives on in the new Santa Fe, but it now makes 185 horsepower at 6,000 RPM and 183 pound-feet of torque at 4,000 RPM for more than adequate performance when compared to the four-cylinder base models that compete in this category. Still, this engine is mated to a rather old-tech four-speed automatic that's smooth but doesn't optimize fuel economy or enhance performance as well as the competition's five- and six-speed automatics. Better is the five-speed automatic in the top-line 3.3-liter V6 model, a 242-horsepower engine with 226 pound-feet of available torque. Sure, some manufacturers provide more peak power, but few distribute it to the road as effortlessly as Hyundai's 3.3 does. Standard on every Santa Fe is a manual mode transmission. It allows you to row through the gears if you want to take on a, a nice, tight, challenging road and gives you a little bit more control over the car. It's also something more common in premium vehicles. And for such a smooth vehicle, the Santa Fe corners pretty well too. And on big hills, the 3.3 liter V6 really pulls. The Santa Fe also comes standard with traction and stability control, critical for keeping it upright and pointed in the right direction if you temporarily lose control. All in all, the Santa Fe measures up, meeting my approval rating as well as impressing the folks at the U.S. Insurance Institute for Highway Safety, where it achieved the highest grade possible by scoring good rankings in every category during its frontal and 40 mile per hour frontal offset crash tests. The 2006 Santa Fe was recently honored with Auto Pacific's Vehicle Satisfaction Award for Mid-Size Sport Utility Vehicles, a title it has held since 2001. Truly, I think the new model is as good a bet as any Japanese rival. So I've got a challenge for you. Try to find a better built, more refined SUV in the mid-size class than the Santa Fe. I couldn't. I'm Trevor Hoffman, signing off for the new driver's seat.